to take the mantle ourselves and start promoting our countries without thinking about these people. Because they don't care about you. See, look at, let's come to Ghana. How can Abeku Santana be a tourism man? Uh, 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 Nelson. I want to link up with you. This guy came. He was he came to my house. We started talking and I asked him where I'm from. He said he's from Kowu. I was like, I've never been to Kowu yet, but I know the biggest hotel in West Africa is in Kowu. I can do a story about you, but I cannot just. I, I'm not that guy who just comes and says, Hey, I put you there and I do a video about you. I can't. But I can take you to one of the biggest hotels in, in Ghana. We go and make video about it. We reach out to the marketing people and then. Let me tell you something. A brand like AY Poyo, which has so much audience out of Ghana, Wanamaya combined together, we're just coming to do a video about this hotel for free. But I cannot come from Takradi and go to Kowu, drive to Kowu for free, and then without even getting a room to sleep. I asked this guy, can I just sleep the following day? Then I come. You know what they told me? They said that no rooms are available. <laughs> and I said, can I pay? and sleep there for a night. It's like, I didn't say you can't pay. I said, no free room for you because our own people don't value us. So that's what I'm telling you. It's time. Thank you. But it's the entire Africa. It's not the only country that I got one of the best treatment was in Swaziland. That's the country that got to know, hey, there's nothing like this. I, I, I nearly met the king. I was going, the tourism minister is a friend of mine. So he got to know that I'm in the country. I was like, I'm gonna search for this boy. The tourism minister, he came, he's like, hey, don't, don't let him walk. Hey, just, just put him in the car, man. The guy, the guy put him in the car, and he took him to like one of the best, and that day was my birthday. Hey, it's the best day of my life. <laughs> no reception, but it's their five star hotel. It's like, you know what, Maya, I'm gonna, I know you want to go to Mozambique, but I'm adding extra one week, and everywhere you sleep, you sleep in there for free. Tell me where you want to go, because I watch you, and I know the values that you're bringing to so many African countries. We want to do the same in this country. I was invited for um, the red dance, but because of Corona, I couldn't go. Just two days ago, I was talking, they said, oh, Maya, we finally got somebody who will be doing what to do. So we love to meet this girl. Like, these are the things that we wish our tourism board will be doing for us. You go to places, tell us, yeah. Like some places you go to vlog, they say, no camera, only phones. Yeah. <laughs> we need to start speaking about these things because these things are hindering the kind of job we want to do. This kind of mentality, like, oh my goodness, I've been arrested. I've been deported because I was broken. It's not so in Africa, man, sometimes. So, I is here. That's why I'm saying this. Thank you, Ivy. I hope... Thank you. Hey, the, the, the Ghana Tourism Board, these are the people that you need to pay them to do the job. You, you guys don't think you deserve that money they are giving to... I hope you share this video for me. If you don't, tag them. Thank you. Thank you so much. Um, I think that what, what Amaya said is absolutely true because I started YouTube not with the thought of wanting to make money. I started YouTube because I love to teach people because I believe that when I teach people, people understand that they are going to use it and make it work. So when I started YouTube, I see people do um, things to do to start a YouTube, things to look out to do a YouTube and all that. 
I decided not to do none of that. What I decided to do was to stay focused with what I am doing. I do interviews, I do teaching. Basically, I'm doing, currently I'm doing teaching on how to start a business, why, to start, why you want to start a business, and how to start a business. And here's what I want to do. Mainly when I, I'm doing videos and I'm uploading, the main thing I'm looking at is the views, really not the subscribers. Because I want to get views, people to just see my stuff. Now, I've realized this thing with many of our 